Hey guys, I'm AJ. I'm Rini. And welcome to the TFA Talk Show. So today, we are very excited to have with us Madi Ramani. Ramadi is from Malaysia, started as a henna artist. From there, he launched his male body arts using henna, where he started working with models and went on with bridal henna and jewelry. He also did a jewelry body arts fashion show in Singapore, where he curated the outfits and accessories, as well as incorporating male body art into it. His passion only grew more and started to venture into designer wear for brides and grooms as well as more upscale events. Madi, thank you so much. So maybe you yeah. might want to share with us more about yourself so that our viewers and listeners can get to know you better. Uh, I did a few events in Malaysia, uh, in the media. I do a fashion show uh, for the Deepawali in Astro. And once the Astro kick off with the top celebrities, I get to know well in Malaysia than all the local Malaysian celebrity are starting to contact me. Then goes on, uh, since I've been based right now in Singapore, uh, Vasantam also contact me for uh, a year ago for their Jeepawali uh, program. So I'll be a sponsor as well um, for the accessory. So I uh, get an offer to uh, doing a runway in Singapore. When come to this part, it's like my concept, the runway is only jewelry and body art. That's the moment when my runway go on, I said, why not I should try in a fashion. It's like, give something else, what I can do. So I want like, unique, be bold in my, like, in the Indian community. So I bring up this concept. So I started my own boutique. So I follow kind of a North Indian. It's like a Sherwani. Um, um, combined like uh, Shervani, I'm more into like Indo-Western. It look traditional, but more to modern, the current uh, trending. And when it comes to Lenga, it's a bridal Lenga, but I don't want to like too cover up, too normal. So that's how I create my look. So And also I love to mix match. If this piece of Lenga, I would not pair the same color. I love to pair with others. As if you notice also in behind my background, there's already have one Lenga. That's I mix match. Like a blouse I did redesign with the bridal linga. It's like a look a model and a part that's a still traditional. We still go for traditional, but current traditional we are like more modern white. So I twist the design on that. Perhaps maybe you could share with us, are there any like simple checklists that we can follow if you wanna uh, if we wanna embark on the path of being a fashion designer? When we are just started, that's how I started earlier. So I'm not so in a fashion industry, I charge an inner heart is and meet the bridals, it's a normal people. So what made me to enter to the industry, the fashion industry, that's me social media. Like a Instagram, YouTube, that's how you get the influence. Like you can get a contact with the photographer uh, and also models. So when you want to enter to the this industry, you need to have a very good um um call what uh, connecting uh with others uh example is already in the fashion industry, as a most important, a good photographer, you need to have a contact. If you are makeup, uh, you need to have a makeup artist contact. You need to have a model. So before I enter this, I have a skill. I go learn also uh, basic photo, uh, photo editing, and also I go take course for my makeup. I take a basic course for my makeup because why we don't know when we need it. The skill to input. Sometimes maybe we already hire a makeup artist. In a runway time, suddenly the makeup artist has not feeling uh, feeling wet. Where you gonna find? So you need to have the basic. So that's how I learn everything. As a social media is a very important to start our business. So marketing is very important. You need to know how to um, market our product. You, you do up a marketing your product. It's very easy to reach to the people and also to the fashion industry. Do you uh, have, like for example, if there's anyone out there who wants to be a budding uh, fashion designer, right? Do you have like a piece of advice for them that you can give uh, when for future, for future budding fashion designer? Okay. There's no advice I will be saying. Always um, be creative. Think out of the box. Don't think that, okay, if this design I do, might be people are not accept. We are never trying. We don't know. Whether sometimes for us look a bit awkward or funny when we creating that look or things, but when we are never into it, nobody know. When our design wise, we need to proud to create our own unique, and bold and stand for it and show off to the market. That's how we need to be sent. 
do, uh, our self confidence is very important when people are say no this cannot you cannot sell in the market but you need to stand firm you need to stand firm say no i can create i think some of others have will be love my arts so i need to create on that so focus on that go for it do not step back when there is a negative thought will be because it's a fashion industry one say yes 10 will say no so go for it just focus yes what are your future plans for marshan boutique okay currently i'm like more focused to the local like um indian costumes and that part right so in the future i want to focus on um for my muslim bride there's uh we are trying to bring more to like um pakistani uh, bride for hijab look so that how we want to create a new style and also um daily wear costume because now uh, now more i focus like bright like special occasion so i want like daily use like normal like uh, tops like kurtis there's a, a very good uh, comment like everyone can wear so like um not only like um focus on a certain um uh, people i want like everyone is to easy to wear and also i'm trying my best to get it all the sizes not only focus to the um, you know currently we like most of outside that for the plus size people it will be very difficult since i'm a plus size so i more focus on that as well so want to like everyone when come to the boutique they get it not uh, like small size or medium or large even extra extra uh, size so i want them to create and also that will be we are combined with our local people like uh, my uh, colleague we gonna have our own challenge several for the fit me uh, fitting in my boutique so you no need like after you purchase need to go for others to get it fit uh, like you no know, ordering everything you can do in uh, everything in my uh, in one place so that's what our future we are planning and also when you come to marshan boutique you want henna you can get it you want jewelry for your bride you can get it you want uh, like a costume for your bride and groom you can get it so we are now on into uh, like want to make it like a wedding planning as well so when you come to marshan boutique for you a to z we going to plan you want to have a catering for your wedding you want to have a makeup artist that's how i'm like working with other top makeup artists on to you know to bring in uh, in one place uh, when bride or groom to enter to my boutique they get it before they step up everything for them already tick their checklist already tick no need to like after okay i'm done my cost oh, i need to go look for my makeup artist which makeup artist so i need to have like a few contact of makeup artist so this how, what i'm planning to do in the future Wow, there's so much positivity and so much energy. I can feel it through, <laughs> you know, just from your sharing. Okay, so Madi, uh, let's say we have our viewers and listeners that wish to connect with you. Where can they do so? Uh, you, I have a two uh, platform social media. There will be um, Facebook. You can connect to Marshan Buti, M A S H A N Buti, and follow by Instagram. Also, that's one of my main uh, place that I always online. uh you can have a look at marshan jewelry and boutique uh, as earlier i say m a s h a n so marshan so this the place i mostly i will be like online active you can see all my works that i working with the local and international celebrity thank you so much uh madi to be on board with us uh very very nice insights um so for those of you who are watching and listening uh, do follow us on our social media at instagram spotify youtube at the freelancers academy And I look forward to seeing you again, Madi.